Incredibly, excitingly new in so many ways that it deserves a new name. Don't worry, Apple's tablet is still called the iPad, but its newest tablet is called the iPad Air. And it's exactly like they say it is, thinner and lighter and faster. It's just like the MacBook Air. The Air will replace the other full-sized iPad. And I don't think too many people will miss the other one. The Air is just 0.29 inches thick and weighs just a pound. It's actually incredibly deceiving when you pick it up. You think because it's got this big screen, it's gonna be really heavy, but it's actually really, really light. I could probably balance this on one finger, but Apple will get really mad. It's that light, guys, it's that light. The tablet is also faster. It has a new A7 chip, which means faster gaming and better multitasking. And like the iPads before it, the iPad Air will start at $499. All the new iPads run iOS 7, which Apple released last month. I have to say I was hoping to see a little bit more in terms of tablet features in the software, though there are new versions of iLife and iWork. But if you're looking for something smaller, Apple's still got its iPad mini, but this has got a new trick too. It's got a higher resolution retina display, which is great for looking at high resolution photos, really nice looking web pages, and also videos. The display is really crisp and packs tons of pixels for its size. Like the Air, it also has that new A7 chip to speed everything up. But that new screen does cost more money. The iPad mini with the Retina display will now start at $399 instead of the $329 it used to cost. Apple did drop the price of the non-Retina iPad to $299 though. That's a good price, but Google's Nexus 7 and Amazon's Kindle Fire HDX start at $229. And that'll be the big question for a lot of people this holiday season. Do they want to go with a cheaper tablet or do they want to go with an iPad that is thinner and lighter and has a really high resolution screen? My guess is a lot of people will end up going with one of these because of that name, iPad.